Please, man, keep this going. I'm addicted. Foster, more the headphones. A little more. It's been two years and 50 some odd days. Yeah, I'm the quest for the best rib. Jimmy, All right, uh, what else do you want to see? Oh, I want to see to perhaps wrap, wrap things up. Here. This is like the smallest entertainment system I've ever seen, but it's so clever and so awesome. Do you want to talk about that just a little bit? Yeah, this is uh, runs off of 100% runs off of 12 volts. So this is an Apple TV. This is a Brookstone projector and a Bluetooth speaker system. It actually projects uh, picture onto the wall. It's about a 50 inch picture. All right. Wow, this is great. I can watch. Uh, I can stream off my iPad if I want to watch. I use a service called Aereo. Okay. Gives me uh, over the air TV because there's no over the air TV out here. Yeah, a lot of people. Oh, sorry. And if I want to do Netflix, I can do Netflix. On oh, all right. Well, yeah, a lot of people I see who have like flat screen TVs. Some of them you have to like restructure your wall to carry right. their weight. And, I mean, this thing right here is like a five pound right. unit, right? Right. Here. And draw. Oh, it only uses 18 watts. That's the. Big oh, okay. Thing. I mean, compared to a TV, you, you can't find a TV that uses 18 watts. I mean, if you do, it's only you know seven inches big. One of those like 1980s wristwatch TVs. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. exactly. How much does something like this cost? These. Two, I think the know? projector is only 300 bucks, okay. and the Apple TV is like 90 bucks, and the speakers, you know. 60 bucks. It's not not that expensive. Now I gotta ask, kind of wrapping things up here. Anything you regret doing if you were to do this over? Is any certain point like I was stupid? I shouldn't have done it that way and would have. Well, if you see this surface mounted cable thing. Yeah. If I was smart, I would have run the wire out there so I didn't have to have that. Okay. So that's one dumb thing. Right. Um, what else, Chris? Give us the. Dirt. I probably would have. I don't especially like the kitchen countertop. I think it's a from like a, it's kind of cheap, but. It was available at the time, I was in a rush, so I just did it. I may actually change it out. Didn't even notice. This is always smart. I mean, this isn't that profound, but just the... Yeah, it's actually from Target. The Russian nesting doll type. Yeah, yeah. You know, just to, to get them out of the way when you're not using them. That'd but actually make a nice project if you're uh, looking for do something. A yeah, one that folds out like yep. in 20 different increments. Yep. It, it becomes a staircase to your loft. That's... <laughs> That's next on RelaxShacks.com. Hey, Chris, thank you so much thank for you the tour. Much. Appreciate it very much. So Chris also has a Tumbleweed XS that he built, and we're going to tour that in another video. So be sure to subscribe, watch, and do whatever you got to do. Thanks for joining us. I'm Derek Dietrichson, again, for RelaxShags.com and Tiny Yellow House. See ya!